Hey guys, my name's Aaron from Geek Academy Development and welcome to the seventh and final part of our TV OS Crash Course. Now if you've made it this far and you've started all from the beginning, you've watched each and every part, then I want to congratulate you. Give yourself a huge pat on the back because you've just made your first full featured TV OS application. And I know, it feels really great. Now in this seventh part, I want to talk about what's next. Now next, I want to set you all a simple challenge. I want you to all add one feature to this application by yourself. It could be something very subtle like changing how the application looks, adding a whole new feature, or even changing the whole theme of the application, such as as it displays cars, change it to bikes, cats, dogs, whatever you like. But add this one brand new feature and make sure that you send it to us on our Twitter. Link to that will be down below. This is to see if all the information you've learned so far can be retained and to take you to the next step to show you that you can actually better the application and turn it into your own app. So once again, feel proud that you've created your very own TV OS application. We've used UI collection views to create our image gallery, we push to a detail view, and we display different types of data depending on what we select. Which makes the application very dynamic and gives it a lot of information and a lot of usability for people using it. And the final thing I want to talk about is your next step within tvOS application development. And that is with our full featured tvOS course. This not only shows you how to create applications from the ground up start to finish and even submit into the app store, but it also shows you how to create 13 real applications just like this one we created in this crash course. So links for this will be down below in the description or underneath the video depending on where you're viewing it. The course has over 17 hours of content and you're guided through each and every step to make sure everything you learn gets retained and you remember and you can create fantastic applications just like the one you created in this crash course. So I'd like to thank you all for watching and all for participating in our crash course. I'm very excited to see where you can take not only the application we created in the course, what the next step you can add to it, but what you also learn and what you create in the future. And any projects that you create, any applications that you have live, make sure you tweet them at us as I love to check those out. So once again, I've been Aaron from Geek Claim Development. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe. And until next time, I will see you all soon. So goodbye. My name's Aaron and I've created this tvOS Swift 2 Apple TV development course. I will teach you all the fundamentals to creating tvOS apps from the ground up, as well as showing you how to create 13 full featured applications. From fun and simple addictive games to powerful utility applications, we'll also be using more advanced features involving core data. I can ensure you that none of this course will blow over your head and you'll be able to retain all the information you have learned to create amazing tvOS applications. So why choose me? Well, for years I've been creating online content teaching students around the world to create their very own dream applications. And already thousands of students are all learning together in my latest courses following their dreams and you can too. So enroll now to start creating your very own applications for Apple's brand new exciting platform and I look forward to seeing you in the course.